First at 5.30 tonight, we are talking to Providence's mayor and the president of the city's firefighters union one day after the mayor said he's open to altering the fire department's work schedule. It's been a month since the city started requiring firefighters to work an average of 56 hours a week. And tonight we're learning how the mayor suggests addressing those concerns. Eyewitness News reporter Steve Nielsen is live in the control room now with the latest developments. Well, guys, to be clear, in the letter that we uncovered, the mayor says that he's willing to change how long some shifts are, what days off firefighters have, but the 56-hour work week is non-negotiable. Providence firefighters continue to go out on calls a month after the mayor switched the schedule from four platoons to three, meaning firefighters now work 56 hours a week. As the legal battle over the change continues, WPRI.com was first to report and uncover this letter from Mayor Jorge Alorza to Union President Paul Dowdy. It says the mayor is willing to change the schedule under a three platoon system. Whatever is most convenient for you, you let me know and I'm happy to work towards accommodating that. This this new schedule now calls for two 10-hour days, then two 14-hour days, and then two days off. No other department in the country, according to both sides, has a schedule like that. Do you prefer to work 24 hours on, then 48 off? There are many different ways that we can do this. I want to do it in a way that's most convenient for them. I think that they are recognizing that they're not on a very strong legal foundation. Dowdy says he's tried to negotiate before. Uh, so they'll make this offer that, hey, you can talk about the hours, but the minute I say, well, I want them back to the way that we had them, they'll say, no, we can't do that. Uh, so they're kind of talking out of both sides of their mouth. Now, to be clear, Olorza is not changing his position on the number of platoons and how many hours they work, but how they get to 56 hours is open to negotiations. I look forward to continue negotiating with them and sitting down at the table to find a resolution that works for everyone. Now, all these changes began in order to save money, save overtime costs. We've asked the mayor's office for all of the firefighting costs for August. That's the first month of this platoon shift. And compare that fi those finances to previous months to verify that it has saved money. They say that they are still crunching those numbers, and they'll provide us that information soon. I'm Steve Nielsen, Eyewitness News.